OTG the family, what's going on, man? It's your boy Way of Life, and we back with another video, man. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. Pause the video, man, and if an ad pop up, make sure y'all watch the entire ad. Don't be skipping the ad, because that's how I'm gonna get this revenue. That's how I'm gonna get this content out for y'all that y'all wanna see, man. Today, got a couple things I wanna talk about, as you see from the thumbnail and the title. But that's gonna get later on in the video right now. I had to go to Advanced Auto Zone, man. If y'all seen the video when I had the Volkswagen, I never put this stuff on my car. I got rollers. I ain't gonna touch it real, real damn ashy. I got two brand new front rollers, two brand new, then I got two back. And I got a set up brake pads for the front and a set for the back, man. I never end up using them because I end up trading my car two months after. So I'm gonna go to AutoZone today. I ain't got the receipts, none of that. I'm gonna see what they can do for me. Maybe they can do some store credit. If they do, I'll pick up a couple things. Or maybe they can give me that dinero, man, that cheese. So stay tuned, man, I'm gonna hop in the car. Gang. I also want to let y'all know, but the merch is on the way. We going with the same logo. I'll post it, follow me on social media so y'all can see it. Way of Life with three Y's. Just like the channel, Instagram, Twitter, man. That's why I post all my um, social media and all that. So make sure y'all follow up with me on there. But the merch gonna go crazy. I think in the first drops, I'm gonna probably do shirts and uh, probably some sweatpants. Maybe a couple shorts because the fall coming. And I'm gonna definitely do some hoodies. So before 2021 over, I'm gonna have hoodies, shirts, shorts, and some sweatpants, man. So make sure y'all stay tuned for that. I know real OTG is gonna shop. I ain't tripping. I'm gonna probably. I'm gonna probably make about 30 pieces each. I don't know, I might have to do some brainstorming on it, man. It's gonna be all the way up there. Put this thing in sport mode. Give me a little. Yes, sir. Hey, running for real. I was looking online today and I seen, damn, call shout out. I seen a JB4 kit for this, like a tuner kit. For like five hundred dollars or whatnot so i got a lot of things i want to do for this i just got to get some stuff out the way man got to pay up some stuff then i can spend that dinero man on things that i want to spend it on see where i'm headed at my turn if you're busting this right this thing quick man panoramic up in the roof do not forget hey so y'all um I actually got them rotors in the other pair of brake pads from um, AutoZone. I thought it was advanced, so I couldn't get the cash. So I just got me a um, little store credit. So we're gonna pick up something here. Then we're gonna go to advance and get the store credit there. And then we're gonna be out of here. So, yes, sir. Make sure I like, comment, subscribe. I don't know if I want to get some cleaning stuff or what. But I'll let y'all see it when we get back in the car. Nah. Back with y'all. Just got up out this um, AutoZone. I actually thought it was advanced that I had got all that stuff from, but I got the four rotors and the brakes from AutoZone, you feel me? And they go ahead and they cash me out, $210. I thought I was gonna just get the discount and get a couple more little goodies or whatever. That little bin is hard. A couple little goodies or whatever, but they cash me out 210, so thank God for that. I know what everybody waiting on is how I got the kill Stinger, what I did, my whole go about, cause I had the Volkswagen for only a year and a half. I know a lot of people wanna know how I did it. So I'm gonna start from the beginning. Got the uh, Volkswagen CC 2020 February. Got rid of it in July 2021. So that's like one year, five months or whatnot. That whole year and a half, I missed no payments, building up my credit, building up my credit. The Volkswagen was only about 18,000, 17,000, something like that. Great deal, I don't know how I got it for that low, but that's how much it was. So I put 2,000 down on the Volkswagen so that was basically a fifteen thousand dollar car loan that i got from the bank approved from my credit union so when i went to go get a new car that week i got this car i was trying to get a charger the whole time basically fast forward they tell me i don't got a credit history which is i don't got a long line of me paying on stuff even though i made payments never missed for a whole year i don't got a long line of doing that so they said they ain't gonna trust me with a big loan this and that i say screw y'all I'm gonna go and take this risk. You know, a lot of y'all be scared to take a risk, but once you take the risk, high risk, high reward, low risk, you ain't gonna get nothing, you feel me? So I could have sat, sat in my corner and been like, oh, I'll keep my Volkswagen, $171 a month, you know, I'm managing my bills good. 
I took the sacrifice, man, and um, God blessed me with a brand new job. He blessed me to get my channel monetized, thankful to y'all and him. So yeah, that's what the sacrifice got me. I took the sacrifice and I got so much back instantly, literally, man. Manifestation, faith in God, and you can do anything you want. So yeah, that's the risk that I took, but that's just a little backstory. On topic now, I had my credit excellent for a year and a half after I got that $15,000 car loan on the Volkswagen, you know, paid all my cars on time. Well, actually, no, I didn't. It was like four months, I ain't even gonna couch, I'm gonna keep it all the way pure. I had ran into a little hole, didn't able, wasn't able to pay my cards. So I obviously thought, since I couldn't pay my cards, like, I paid my cards, but they wasn't all off, you feel me? I was paying a little bit here, a little bit there, just managing because I was doing some other stuff. And I thought for sure I wasn't going to be able to get into anything. So I went there with the motive of I'm just going to look at this car. And um, once we sat down, once we did the paperwork, this and that, you know, let them know that I had a trade in, traded my Volkswagen in. They tried to hit me over the head for that. But nevertheless, you messing with a ball, so they wasn't able to do that. So I got 8500 for my Volkswagen. I only owe on my Volkswagen 6900 so do the math. I had a few, you feel me, positive equity, a few thousand, couple thousand positive equity. And I used that to put down on the Stinger. I didn't put no money out my pocket. That's what y'all gotta know. Them people want y'all to put money out y'all pocket if y'all trade a vehicle because it's way better for them. You know, if you know how to slick and you know how to talk, you don't gotta do that. I ain't, man, that's a bit hard. I ain't have to do that. So basically it was 2,000 down on the Stinger gave me a they gave me a high interest rate i ain't gonna lie now my volkswagen i had a 3.3 171 dollars a month but seeing i'm young a lot of people who don't understand how this car stuff go what i'm finna tell y'all y'all just say i got hit over the head this and that no i didn't the car was thirty thousand sixty six dollars we brought him down three thousand shout out to my brother he worked in the car industry so he know he extra he really knew what to say and this and that so the car was $30,066, that's it. Interest rate that they gave me was high, but you gotta understand, I'm 21, I only had a few notions of credit history, they wasn't established that long. So I had to take a risk and high risk, high reward, man, I got blessed tenfold on the back end. So. I thank the most high for that, man. And I thank y'all for watching the channel. I was able to do something like that. So with that 11% interest rate, man, from a 3.3171 a month to 11% interest rate on a $30,000 car, it put my payments at $650, man. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. When I heard that, I was expecting, right, you know, $350, four, you know, seeing what type of car. I was thinking 650 would be a scat pack or something like that. I know a bunch of guys that got scats for 600 a month, 590 a month. If you get one with a little extra little mookie, just little miles, you know. But I thought about it, you know, I told the dude, all right, okay, well, I'm gonna go outside, you know, I'm gonna drink me a soda and I'm gonna think about it. What I told myself is, James, if you don't start now with this big loan, Unless you got that extra cheese out the pocket to put on top, which I'm never going to do. I'm never going to put a big lump sum of money on a vehicle because it's not that serious to me because you don't have to do that if you got credit. I told myself, you know what, six fifty dollars a month, after six months I can refinance because once you get the loan, you can go to your credit union because you got the loan, you know, and you paid on it six, seven months, eight months straight. You, they know you can afford it they gonna know that damn we was wrong we should have did it directly through us but you know it don't always go like that it's only gonna go god's way so i'm gonna refinance and it'll probably bring it down maybe five something hopefully four something and yeah 650 a month man for the kia stinger y'all can talk all the stuff y'all want y'all don't really know how this car stuff go you gotta take a risk i don't have no cosigns or anything like that you feel me did it all on my own did my volkswagen on my own no money down on this car. 650 a month. You got to take that risk, man. And I took it. I'm proud of it because I know what I'm going to get out of this. You feel me? I done made 650 back. I don't know how many times, but I got to, you know, every month, boom, 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 boom. But after six, seven months, man, I'm going to refinance and then I get an extra little cheese on top. 
So I ain't really worried about it. But yeah, man, that's what it took for me to get into the Stinger out of the Volkswagen in a year and five, six months. So I want y'all to know exactly how it went. I'm gonna run this thing step by step. Got the Volkswagen, building credit for a year and a half, traded the Volkswagen, positive equity, is what you need to trade and get into a new car that fast. Or have the extra cheese on top, you feel me, out of pocket, boom. You don't worry about all that, you feel me? But you're gonna be you're gonna be dumping a lot of money, especially if you want a high-priced car. You know, got into the Kia Stinger, 11% interest rate, 650 a month, and I'm gonna be back at y'all in about six months telling y'all how I'm paying four. You feel me? I'm gonna put faith on, I'm gonna put 450 a month. That's what I'm shooting for. You feel me? And once you refinance, you can bring an extra thousand or two and put down, even after having a car. That's what, you know, it's a lot of logistics, analytics to the stuff y'all got to know. But if you listen to me, I ain't going to lie to y'all. I could have lied to y'all and told y'all I got a 2.0 for 300 a month, this and that. That ain't going to help y'all get into the cars that y'all want. You feel me? My next car is definitely fifty, sixty thousand dollars loan, seventy, because the bag is only getting bigger by the day. You feel me? And the credit history is getting bigger by the month. So, ain't no way it's not gonna be there. So I took this risk, man, and I feel good about it. I already done made three payments ahead, so I'm good to about November, end of November, man. I ain't tripping. Six fifty a month. Hey, little drop in the bucket, man. You know, I was working at Home Depot. I'm going past Home Depot, literally, right now. Working there, my checks was, you know, making about 1600 a month. Now, God bless me with a new job, man, I'm up there. You feel me? I ain't, you know, I'm up there. So I ain't gonna put all the mook out there, but I'm, I'm way over that. So that's, you know, and I got this stinger right before I left Home Depot with $1,600 a month. So that let y'all know, listen to me, I just laid it all out there for y'all. You can do the same stuff if you got this uh, minimum requirement or or a little bit higher, man, or way higher. I want y'all to know that. I want y'all to take notes because this stuff is real. You got to take these risks, man, if you want these cars, if you want these houses. Build your credit. That's what it is, man. This your boy way of life, man. Little rose gold move. Matching the feet. We just living, man. I thank God. I thank all y'all. We going up. Got a lot of stuff for the Stinger coming. Just ran into some OTG fam at the Auto Zone. I ain't even know, bro. You feel me? Appreciate him and everybody else that see me out. The car gonna come more noticeable. You feel me? But we ain't gonna be here for long. We gonna get a spot and it's gonna be so grand. I'm claiming it not, man. But this your boy Way of Life. That's all I got to say on that, man. I'm gonna hit y'all with some B-roll. Yes, sir. Gang. So YouTube, man, just got up out this on uh, Chipotle. You gotta have that Chipotle. <clears throat> For me, Chipotle and that Smoothie King, that shit hit right every single time, man. A little fill up, I'm going 89 a day, man, saving a little bread. I ain't on cap with y'all, I don't go 93 every time. And I need to say I'm putting 89 in here. I thought I was gonna be able to get some more stuff at the other store, but they gave me the cash, so I just pocketed that. Got the microfiber tiles. These smell good, boy. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Got this right here. Got a couple more air fresheners. Wheel cleaner. Got a little back Oreo. Put them in the car. But yes, sir, OTG, man, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe, man, on this video. Hit the subscribe button, turn on the bell, so we can get all this watch time. Watch the whole video, watch the whole ass, don't be skipping, man. We're going to get this content out for y'all, man. It's your boy, Web Life. We hopping in the wood, finna hit the house. That's it. Yes, sir. Gang.